This tutorial will show you on how to install WordPress on your domain. Firstly, log in to your cPanel account. Scroll down until you see Softaculous Auto Installer or this WordPress icon. Click on WordPress icon and then click on Install. If you want SSL, make sure that you choose HTTPS here. Choose the domain that you want from this drop-down list. If you want to install WordPress on a subfolder, for example, creatorelectric.com slash blog, you can insert the subfolder spelling, in this case, blog, here. In this demo, we will install WordPress on the main domain only, so, just leave this field empty. Here is where you insert your site name. You can write anything here, because it can be re-edited later on. Then, insert your site description here. You can insert anything here too, since it can be re-edited later too. To edit your WordPress website later on, this is the username that you will be using. You can enter any username you want, for example, ABC Admin XYZ or admin, or anything, but bear in mind that this username is permanent. Once chosen, it cannot be changed anymore later on. Then, insert the password for your WP admin manually here. You can insert any password you want, as long as it's strong. You can change this password anytime later. Alternatively, you can also click on this key icon to generate password automatically. Before that, kindly click on this show button so that you can see the password suggested and click on this key icon repeatedly until you see a password you like. Once chosen, kindly copy the password first and paste it somewhere else, for example, in Notepad, so that you can save it somewhere safe later. Then, insert your existing email address that you often use here, preferably a Gmail account, because, just in case you forget your password and click Reset Password, the new password will be sent to that email address. Then, click Install. Wait for a few seconds until installation completes. Congratulations! You have successfully installed WordPress on your domain. This is the URL to log in to your WP admin, where you can edit your website from now on. Click on this link to log in to your WordPress dashboard automatically. And you will see this dashboard. Another way to log in to your WP admin is by logging in manually, like this. To edit your website, you can create page, create post, install theme, install plugins, and many more. WordPress provides free themes if you want to use them. You can find them here. However, if you have an extra budget, and you want to have a ready-made beautiful and professional looking theme, you can always buy a premium theme out there. Make sure though, that the themes and plugins that you buy, are off original versions, that is not a nulled or pirated version, to prevent your website from loading slowly, or getting hacked. If you want a web design service from NetKL, kindly contact our support team, and request for a quotation. All the best! Thanks for watching! If you need any assistance, kindly contact us at support at netkl.com.